Hello everyone and welcome to this video of CodeBeamer's X-Unit importer Jenkins plugin. In this video, you will see an example of how you can import automated test run results to a project in CodeBeamer via this interface. On the left hand side of the screen, you can see a project in a CodeBeamer instance. And on the right hand side, you can see the configuration screen of a Jenkins instance. First, let me show you what the Jenkins plugin will create in CodeBeamer. If I go to my test case tracker, I have a folder set up here called Automated Tests. That's where the test cases from Jenkins will be populated into. I also have my automated test runs, and the plugin will create a test run here as well. Besides that, I need to set up my test configuration too. So now my CodeBeamer project is ready to manage test results. Let's see what we should set up and configure in Jenkins in order to get the results imported to the proper places in CodeBeamer. If I scroll down with my Jenkins project configuration, after selecting the CodeBeamer's XUnit plugin, First, you will need to specify your CodeBeamer's URL with the appropriate credentials. Then we can provide the IDs of each and every item that we would like to import into. All the required fields in Jenkins will be marked. Therefore, I look into my test configuration to get the ID of my automated test configured item. As you can see here, I can copy it from the right in the item and then paste it into Jenkins configuration. Then we do the same for test cases. I select the proper test case tracker, look for its ID number, and then paste it into Jenkins. Depending on whether I would like to have my results from my test cases imported into the tracker or into a folder within the tracker, there is an option to provide a test case ID as well. Let's open our automated test case folder and copy its ID number to Jenkins. Finally, I will provide the test run tracker's ID. To start the importing of results, click on Save. And then click on Build Now. After it has completed, I'm going to refresh my CodeBeamer instance and see what it looks like. It has finished, so let's review the test cases. As you can see in the automated test cases folder, I have my imported test cases already from Jenkins. If I go to my test runs, I can see the results as well and who has submitted them and when. Now we link our test cases to the specific system requirements that they are related to. So, let's say these were runs against system requirements. I'm going to open up the tracker and see the different items within those. Within the right side of CodeBeamer's window, we can select the test case library in which we can search for our new test cases. Populating it, we can find those, and then with a single drag and drop movement, we can link it to any of our requirements. In the pop-up window, we can select whether we want to verify the item or if we want to create a copy of the item and verify that one. After clicking on Save, the only remaining things is to check 
is our test coverage. Once we have drilled down our requirements, we can see all the results with the corresponding details. Thank you for watching this video. For further questions, please don't hesitate to contact us.